Get to the story, man. Shut up. I want to play this game. And it's stupid. My guys keep running into the grenades. Pokemon. Yeah. Like, really? Which one came first? <laughs> Explain this to me. Explain it. Still up. That goes on with the Pokemon. We can like, never have Pokemon bang, so we won't give them a butt. Yeah. Roll. <laughs> That's gonna be in black and white before. <laughs> hey guys, Cool Blind Way back. I'm Aaron. I'm Calvin. Rick. Eric. And we are here with a movie chosen by the people over at Patreon and BlindWave.com. This time it is Total Recall. Yeah, we had oh. an Arnold poll. And I had to choose Omar. from some choice movies. Some yeah. Really great choices. Yeah. Now, this is the only one that I have seen. Um, I think Eric is the main one here that has I have never seen Total Recall. Recall. Or the, the uh, there was a remake, wasn't there? There was a remake. There was a remake. I, was a remake. The remake I, I have seen the remake once when it came out. I did oh. not like it as much. <laughs> I only really know two things about this movie. Okay. Do you want to say what they are? Because we've all seen it. Mars, extra titty. What? Neither of those words make any sense, Eric. Now, it's been a long time since I've seen this, so I may have forgotten too, so we'll see what happens. But. Okay. It's been a bit since I've seen yeah. this as well. I can't remember the last time I've watched this. It's been probably it's been three years. Been. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry. It's the way you said it. <clears throat> this is... See? Yeah, I get it. <laughs> but that's where we are. We're going to enjoy some Total Recall. If you want to enjoy the entire thing with us, don't forget there is full length available for the reaction over at blindwave.com. Mm -hmm. You will have a highlight of what, uh, what we've seen here on YouTube. But if you want to see our entire reaction, make sure you check it out over there, uncut, at blindwave.com. Yep. All right. Yeah. And you can recommend us movies and shows over there as well just by making an account. And you can hop one of those polls and vote for when they come around every other week. Yes. So check out blindwave.com. Link in the description below. Now. Hit that mouse. Are we watching the Barbarian? What? Just very similar intros. I've never seen Conan, so I don't know. It's very it similar. Very similar. Yeah, I the last time I watched I, the last time I watched this I was like, huh. A lot of Arnold movies have this kind of music. It's crazy. Well, well, what year was this? Uh 90? 90? I'd look at my phone, but I don't have it. I wanna say it was nineteen ninety. That was some solid model work, it looked like. 90. Ooh, 1990. Yeah. Damn, man, this movie's almost as old as I am. I know. Crazy, huh? It's older than me. It's older than you, Calvin. Yeah, it's nuts. I don't understand. They don't have lights in their helmet to show their face. Eric. <laughs> Stop complaining about the thing that you like. <laughs> they didn't do it. Be happy. Oh, God! Ah! Ah! The first sound you hear! Oh! Oh, no! Oh my god, the depressurization! Oh! Doesn't that look so fucking good? Oh my god! In the How first can you guys minute. Watch that? In the first minute. I've never been able to unsee it, Eric, Ugh. in all these 30 some years. I don't, I don't, give me the. Give me that pickle. I'm not getting the pickles. Give me that pickle. <laughs> you you will get total recall if you eat this pickle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> on, if you, you have to eat a pickle on every you know sandwich what? for the rest of your life. A pickle sandwich isn't bad. I just don't like pickles on like a hamburger. Pizza? Yeah. yeah. Eats hot dogs? Can I eat fun. around the pickle? Yeah, but a hot dog's on a sandwich, right? So like now you don't have a pickle on. Can, yeah, I, can I eat the sandwich and just eat around the pickle? Who is she? Nobody. I don't know. Tell me. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> We're terrorists demanding independence. Once again, halted the extraction of turbinium ore. <laughs> Mars military restored order with minimal use of force. I'm gonna watch it expand. <laughs> That's so cool. 1990. It's almost true now, right? Like you can just. Oh yeah, you could do this now. Lori, don't you understand? I feel like I was meant for something more than this. I want to do something with my life. I want to be somebody. You are somebody. You're the man I love. He doesn't look like right. a duck. Why not? I don't know. Have a nice day. I need to get a list of all the Arnold names he has in his movies and be like, which one of these does he look like? Because he looks like an Arnold. <laughs> does he look like a Harry? Harry. Yeah. More than Doug. John. Josh. Does he look like a John? Yeah. More of a Doug than a Walter? Yeah, maybe. Ooh, cool. Oh, sweet. <laughs> It looks pretty good. It looks yeah. great, yeah. 1990. We're, we're going to be saying that the whole movie. Because <laughs> it looks so good. This is my favorite part of watching horror movies. Then come to Recall Incorporated. 
where you can buy the memory of your ideal vacation uh, cheaper, safer, and better than the real thing. Cool. So don't let life pass you by. Call Recall for the memory of a lifetime. Jingles. Okay. <laughs> recall, recall. So you can buy memories. That's cool. Jeez. This is why his name is Doug. Gotta do the digging. Dig, Dig Doug. Doug. <laughs> oh, recall, 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 recall. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe. Well, don't. Why not? Well, don't. A friend of mine tried one of their special offers. Nearly got himself lobotomized. Eric would not be the first person to test that. You're already fucking with your ears. Where's your protection? <laughs> It would be, yeah, right, that guy back there has like a hat, yeah. glasses. They got nothing. Yeah, no. Isn't what we talk about with like neural link, like right? Zordon's like, place. If you mess and Sorry. give yourself memories you don't have, like what's that, what would that be like, you know? Yeah. The command so, center, Rick, is that what it was? Looked like Zordon's, yeah, yeah. command center back there. Yeah. Oh, Dude, man, was... if this was real, <laughs> I feel like you That's could have like just fake nails you put on that are digitally like little LEDs little, or little something. Screen, so. no, I'm not interested in Saturn. I said Moss. Okay. He's the planet of his dreams. Mars is. No, I'm telling you, Doug, your brain will not know the difference. And that's guaranteed. Or your money back. What about the guy you lobotomized? Did he get a refund? You're talking ancient history. Whose memories are they? Besides, a real holiday is a pain in the butt. You got lost luggage. Lousy weather, crooked taxi drivers. When you travel with recall, everything is perfect. In my head, I'm designing a business around recall. That's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> what is it that is exactly the same about every single vacation you have ever taken? Thank you, Doug. You? Let me suggest that you take a vacation from yourself. And I know, it sounds wild. It is the latest thing in travel. We call it the ego trip. <laughs> Playboy, or a famous jock, or... Secret agent. How much is that? Ah. So the bottom, they're gonna get you. This guy's a great salesman. Yeah. Mm -hmm. People are trying to kill you left and right. You meet this beautiful, exotic woman. Come on. What color is her hair? I don't want to spoil it for you, Doug. Get the girl, kill the bad guys, and save the entire planet. Now you tell me, isn't that worth a measly 300 credits? 300 <laughs> Great decision. <laughs> oh, his eyes don't burst out, I'll be good. Well, don't worry, things hardly ever fuck up around here. <sighs> Love to hear that. <laughs> don't you keep up with the news? We're doing alien artifacts now. Wow. Yeah, they dig back a million years. Hmm. So that's not like conspiracy right. stuff, that's real? That's a new one. We'll Dating back in. That's what they say. <laughs> Menu select level four women. <laughs> Blonde, brunette, redhead. Redhead. Brunette. Damn it. Part. 41A, Ernie. 41A? Why did he not get a choice on that one? She's the expert. Oh, was it not cup size? No. Was it a model? It was a well, model. Right when they did that, she went like this. And it was like 41A, 76B, 55C. <laughs> I was like, oh, it's a cup size thing. For just a few more credits, we supply t shirts, snapshots of you at the site, and even letters. What? What's going on? Is that them on the phone? <laughs> okay. What is it? You better get down here. Now, look, I am with a very important client. It looks like we got another schizoid embolism. Huh? Schizoid embolism. Uh, this is a lobotomy? Uh, what happened to the one guy? Uh, oh my gosh! Oh my god! You broke my cover! Fuck around! You can't do a simple goddamn double implant! My head is not quaint! I knew you didn't like it, Doug. They ain't jigging him a shit ton, didn't they? Yeah. Oh yeah. There's bubbles in it. That doesn't stop them. It's really been there. Use your head, you dumb bitch. She's just acting out the secret agent portion of his ego trip. I'm afraid that's not possible. Why not? Because we haven't implanted it yet. Huh. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I've been trying to tell you. Someone has erased his memory. Wait, excuse uh. me. 
talking about the fucking agency. Shut up, Bob! <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> All right, look, here's what we're gonna do. Renata, cover up any memory that he's got of us or recall. I'll do what I can. It's pretty messy in there. And if anybody comes asking, we never even heard of Douglas Quaid. Okay. Well, so are those real memories that he's having then? In his dreams? Hmm. Oh my god, that's terrifying. <laughs> You're in a Johnny Cat. I mean, what am I doing uh, here? I'm sorry. It's so uncanny, huh? Can please rephrase the question. Huh? How did I get in this taxi? <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Rolling his eyes. Ugh. Polar Express. Yeah. It, it does give Polar, Polar Express, Express vibes. better. The eyes were creepy, though. You went to recall, remember? That's it? Yeah, you did. Listen, I've already been thinking about it. Hey! Oh, my God! Hold on! I'm quaint! The plan's about Mars! Are you crazy? I don't even know anything about Mars! You should've listened to me, Quaid. I was there to keep you out of trouble. <laughs> You got yourself mixed up with something. Oh! No, Detective Bullock! Yeah! Oh! Damn. Oh! Okay, he's got moves. He probably didn't even know he had. Look at this guy, man. Oh! Don't get squibs like that anymore. No, you do not. I mean, to be fair, he never questioned his amazingly sculpted body. I mean, he's, he's a, a construction, construction worker. Oh, they don't look like that. <laughs> Some do. Harry was right next to him doing the same <laughs> shit. Come on. <laughs> oh, <you're> right. <laughs> Genetics, Eric. Look at you. Look at me. <laughs> Are you all right? No, there was fire. She in on it too. And Harry from work, he was the get down. Get down. Harry from work, he was the boss. Take it easy. Mars never even been to Mars. That sounds crazy. See, I went to the recall place after the You went to those bringing butchers? Let me finish. What did they do to you? Tell me. I went to Mars. There's a without them. Well, forget about the recall, no. will you? I killed them. <laughs> I called this evolution. <laughs> Should've started that. Waiting at that, Lori. Seth, I'm gonna call a doctor. Nope, no, I don't trust Lori. I don't call anybody. Oh, Michael Ironside. <laughs> That's not the face you want. <laughs> what do you mean? What's wrong with him? No, it's great, but he, I don't think he's the... He's the doctor. He wants to make sure he's doctor. okay. Something's wrong with him. Yeah. <laughs> Did he even move? She... Oh. Where'd I go? Get out! Motherfucker. It is... Ah! Not a very good shot. It's dark. He had a gun, he had a stool, he wins. Uh-huh. Oh, again! Oh, guard your nuts! Oh. Jeez. Watch out for knives. Uh. Implanted. Our friends, my job eight years together. Suppose all of this was implanted too. The job's real. The agency set it up. You found me. Who the hell am I? It's me. I just work here. That's incredibly violating, <laughs> lady. <laughs> you can't just say I just work here. <laughs> <laughs> you were the best assignment I ever had. Really. I'm on it. Here comes the doctor. She stabbed her chest. Slice. More cereal. <laughs> More cereal fell. Damn. It's a cool location. Yeah. It's really cool, yeah. Who was he that they would do this and not just kill him? It's gotta be. Very important. They're really hungry. 
<laughs> Subway this way! Cool. <laughs> oh, this is so cool! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> That's fine. You could have had a little bit of a fight there, maybe, but it was still cool. Skeleton fight. Yeah. 1990. Seeing like bones You're break. Right, that would have been so cool. Oh, <laughs> they would do that now. Yeah. Oh, oh my god! Poor guy! Oh, those just... squibs! Don't care. Dude, these guys tear people up. Yep. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Oh, his on his face. Yeah. And director's robo Look at this guy. Poor guy. Oh. And it's just okay. a, Yeah. You're right. Robocop director, I see it now. <laughs> Those are some violent squibs. Extremely violent. That broke real easy. Oh. shooting in the crowd. Oh. You're not even shooting at him, you're just shooting. Damn what? all that glass. Should've done what he did. Shoot the glass and jump in. Shoot the glass. I don't blame you, man. Lady. You she likes it? No, I'm sure she hated every minute of it. <laughs> was she like the, considered that was she the, Yeah, was she like the only person he could get? Lori says he can't remember Jack's shit. That's now and now we could have total recall. He said the thing. Drink. You got it. what you do on the channel, sir. I've got sun fox. <laughs> what a fucking. <laughs> so they have a tracker on them. What do you want? They've got your bug. They'll be busted down your door in about three minutes unless you do exactly what I say. Who are you? Never mind. What is this? Wrap it around your head. That'll muffle the signal. Ugh. What? I don't know. Just something like a, just a wet towel just wrapping around my head just feels. Ugh. Better than wet socks. On your feet or around Especially your head. if it's cold. A cold, wet towel. It's better than everything else that's happened to him for the last <laughs> 20 minutes. <laughs> I guess. Oh. We're buddies of the agency back on Mars. You asked me if you disappeared to come and find you, so here I am. Okay. Bye. What was I doing on Mars? So he was part of the agency. Good thing no one stole that. And they called him a traitor, okay. Hey, lady. This is mine. Put your name on it. Someone left it for me. Man, what are you doing? Look at it. Puncher! Give it up, you old bag! <laughs> Kicker! <laughs> it's more like that old lady in Super Mario Brothers the movie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Shit. I'm not familiar with that address. Would you please repeat it? Fucking no! <laughs> Johnny Reed! No! <laughs> what Johnny Cab ever do to you? <laughs> Just, he's the drift king. Show me dickhead. <gasps> Did that robot is trying to get revenge? <laughs> you can't not pay the fare. <laughs> Does that answer your question? <laughs> he, he laughed at it. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed the ride. <laughs> So perfect. 1990. In the camera movement. How is stranger? This is Hauser. Hauser. If things have gone wrong, I'm talking to myself. You've got a bit of power up there. <laughs> you. I'm with you. You're me. No shit. I knew he wasn't a Doug He doesn't even like Doug Hauser. <laughs> and here comes the hard part, old buddy. Now it is all up to you. <laughs> Take this thing out of the case and stick it up your nose. Huh? Don't worry, it's self guiding. Uh, is it? Oh, oh god. You have crunch, you're there. Ugh. Just pull it out. Ugh. See it glowing? They have a prosthetic of his head. Oh, 
Ugh. That thing's so big. 1990. Dude, Arnold always has to make like Dude, a sculpt can... of his head and like all of his birth out of his nose. Yeah. I don't know how your nose isn't permanently flat in the wind now. That was that was a jawbreaker, dude. Stretchy, yeah. man. Stretchy. These dirt No rats, no! No. <laughs> that rat must be it's like, so it's like Predator. <laughs> They're just like, it's over there! And they start shooting. You know what I love? That that rat is unafraid of danger. It's so food motivated. <laughs> <laughs> Ship. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's a weird smile. Have you brought any fruits or vegetables onto the planet? Two weeks. Excuse me? Two weeks. Uh-huh. Oh. Two weeks. Oh. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> Hello, Sumit's off! Oh. Dude, this lady's acting. Yeah. Oh! Wow! Holy crap! Nineteen ninety. Get ready for a surprise. <laughs> 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 oh my gosh, I love it. Mission Impossible wishes it could do that. Right. I was like, well, this lady has his bag and she's six foot five. <laughs> <laughs> She's also the brightest dressed thing in the scene, which I thought was interesting. Yeah. Everything else was a lot more muted, browns, yeah. grays, blacks. I feel like there should be an auto sensor. Right. Yeah, right? It just does this. Excuse me, what's that? Oh, this guy. You mean the pyramid uh, line? Closed boots in your motorcycle. Yep. That's him. That's him. Well, that's a rumor, isn't it? Is he like did what he does? Like I star in Arnold movies. This looks good. Mm-hmm. Oh, a little weird. Like, a little bit sure. weird. Yeah, where two things were moving like this at the same time. But it was miniature like, work is it's, amazing. It's an impressive model. If the rebels win, it all might end. Yeah. 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 It's a different Arnold movie. The Eraser. Yeah. Is that the one with the devil? That's no. a different Arnold movie. <laughs> yeah, that's End of Days. <laughs> well, that was the sixth day. No, that's the clones. Oh. Yeah. Different Arnold movie. A different Arnold movie. <laughs> no, that's twins. <laughs> Damn. Oh. Sex, sex. The last resort. Cool. <laughs> hey, man, that's my bear. Hey, asshole, that's my bear. Eat this, damn you, mini. <laughs> Shit. Vinny, I don't think you were lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Revolution can happen anytime, right? Mars today. Welcome to Mars. <laughs> he just goes. Yeah. This is just like a normal day for him. Last three to one. Pepsi. They have Pepsi and Coke. They don't give a fuck. That's why Pepsi. there's a war. Pepsi on Mars. Coke <laughs> yeah, on and you're right. <laughs> <laughs> That's Coke on Mars. Benny. Benny. I'll never forget Benny. Sounds like a Sonic level. Yeah. Totally. Mel. Hey, Mel. Is that the... Is that the same way that was the model in the in the recall? The digital lady? Yeah. The one from his dream. Yeah, from the dream, but... <laughs> Hello, Hauser. Still bulging, I see. 
Blondes. Blondes. You got a lot of nerve showing your face around here, Hauser. Yes. Isn't that uh uh from Breaking Bad? Yes. Uh, uh why am I blanking on his name right now? Minerals? Yes. Laurie! Minerals? Yeah. What's his name? Why, why am I forgetting his name right now? Hank. Isn't that Hank? That's totally Hank. Yeah. You son of a bitch. You're alive. I thought they called you and tortured you to death. I guess he didn't. And you couldn't get me a message? He stole his soul. How's it been because you're alive? I don't remember you. What are you talking about? I don't remember you. I don't remember us. Hauser left me a note. Hauser, you're Hauser. Not anymore. Now I'm Quaid. Douglas Quaid. Doug. Hauser, you've lost your mind. Are you fucking married? She wasn't really my wife. Oh, she isn't really your wife. How stupid of me. She was Hauser's wife? Look, forget that I said you was Michael Ironside's wife. <laughs> yeah, she was Richter's <laughs> wife. <laughs> you just used me to get inside. Inside what? Agent? See? Please, people are trying to kill me. Really? I'll be like, you don't think I could come up with something different? <laughs> <laughs> something a little, a little more original? Yeah. Wait. What? I didn't talk to you about Mr. House. I didn't Who are you? Dr. Hedgehog from Rico. How did you find me? It's a little difficult to explain. Could you open the door? I'm unarmed. I'm afraid you're not really standing here right now. You're strapped into an implant chair. I'm monitoring you from the Psycho Pro console. Oh, this is cool. Which is going to even pay me for this? Think about it. Your dream started in the middle of the implant procedure. Everything after that, the chases, the trip to the house, the suite that they opened. Yeah, the chain of custody. I didn't see it. <laughs> you paid to be a secret agent. Bullshit. Why about the girl? Damn it, mate. Yeah. How about the girl? Damn it, it got me. I don't know where I am now. <laughs> Damn you guys for having seen this. <laughs> Lori. Come in, Mrs. Ray. I want you to come back to me. She's not blanking. <laughs> what? Blank? Bullshit. What's bullshit, Mr. Ray? Swallow this. What is it? It's a symbol of your desire to return to reality. Besides your dreams, you even have fantasies about alien civilizations, as you requested. But in the end, back on Earth, you'll be lobotomized. So get a grip on yourself, dog, and put down that gun. Bam. We're a tight spot, Doug. Mm-hmm. But don't... Uh, Swallow it. Look at your body, man. Your body! His body, yes, about his it's mind. the one thing that doesn't add up. <sighs> wow. <laughs> now you've done it. Now you've done it. Oh my uh. god. Balls have been abused or abused or both. Yeah, so much. This is only a weak spot. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> yeah. Are you surprised that Superman, their boys, bring out the kryptonite? They always are, right? Yeah. Well, Ironside's always just running somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> that's, 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 Subway. That's what they do this whole movie. <laughs> Eat fresh. Eat fresh. I'm gonna say she believes him. <laughs> Oh, don't try it now. Hi. Ugh. We're married. Good. She don't break it, so she grab a gun. Is it a divorce? That was your wife. <laughs> don't get mad at me. <laughs> I had no control of it. <laughs> that doctor had no fear. 
when he had his well, gun was in. He did have sweat. a sweat. <laughs> well, yeah. I mean, but he didn't show it. On his yeah. It's rough, buddy. What? Oh! Please! <laughs> okay. The only real problem is the mat line with those. That's it. Sure, yeah. And it's, and the it's, it's the 90s. It's pretty yeah. good, too. It's not bad. Don't crack the dome. The dome will crack. I don't want to crack the dome. That dome should be stronger. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if the rock tumbles down the mountain, it's going to yeah. kill everybody. Well, they also don't care about everybody. I uh, guess you're right. They just need the, the fuel. It's as thin as it has to be. It's really like a mining town, right? Yeah. yeah. Like, on, just on Mars. Hey, of course he's here. You guys are in trouble. Oh, damn. Man. Man, that guy hit a pole, too. I love stunts. Those guys put so much, they don't get enough brains. Oh. <laughs> Why didn't you start oh, with that one? <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't want to do that to my shoulders. <laughs> Bonsai. You're in this now, Benny. He's like, I'm just trying to make a living. <laughs> Why you do this Five to kids? Me? So he's probably psychic, huh? At least the mutants. Well, all psychics well, they... are mutants, but not all mutants are psychics. Yeah, that's kind of what they had said, was that all psychics were mutant yeah. people. Damn! Yeah. No! Oh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> that is a big knife! Stab him in the dick! Good! What were they thinking? Just kill every patron in this bar? Yeah! Get out of sector G now. Don't think. Do it. Yes, sir. Yeah. 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 Well, they shut off the air. Ugh. And if you want to breathe, you have to buy his air. Maybe you can change all that. Like maybe you'll remember that you love me. I don't need quite quarter for that. <laughs> Since when? That was so unexpected. <laughs> <laughs> Looked pretty good, didn't it? Yeah, but I just... Holy crap. That's why we brought you here. Kohagen's big secret is buried in that black hole you call a brain. Wait. I'm just remembering that episode of Rick and Morty. And I never saw Total, Total, Total Recall. His voice? Same as you, remember. But why? To be myself again. You are what you do. A man is defined by his action, not his memory. Please, take my hand. Please. Open your mind. Open your mind. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's what it is. I completely oh. forgot it. I wrote it earlier to count. Yeah. I wrote it like, I forgot this. Right there was an episode of Rick and Morty where everybody had a quantum. Right? <laughs> now I know what that means. I kept, I kept thinking like, I don't know what this is. <laughs> mind palace. Is this the... The big thing? Quato's hand, right? Mm. It's a hand. I don't know if it's Quato's. Yes. They drilled here. Put your shirt back on. <sighs> so. Benny, hurry. Benny. 
Quato. I knew he gave a weird look earlier. Congratulations, Glaive. You let us right to it. Damn. I have four kids to feed. That was fun. So what happened to number five? Ah, <laughs> oh, shit, man. You got me. He just always happened to be in the taxi where you need him. Just a plant. <laughs> Damn it. Wait. Oh my god. Stop the reactor. Three more. <clears throat> Mr. Cohagen would like to talk to you. <sighs> Who's a liar? You're a hero. Yeah, right? <laughs> Towser volunteered to become Doug Quaid. It was the only way to fool the psychics. Well, get your story straight. This idiot has been trying to kill me ever since I went to recall. You set him off by going to recall. So why am I still alive? We gave you lots of help. Many of you. My pleasure, man. Got with the suitcase, the mask, the money, the message from Hauser. All of that was set up by us. Sorry. Too perfect. Perfect. My ass. It's the best mindfuck yet. Oh. Don't take my word. I kind of believe Someone this one. It's Hauser again. Ugh. Howdy, Quaid. If you're listening to this, it means that Quato is dead. You're listening. It's my body of Gatia. And I want it back. Sorry to be an indicator. You're so mean to yourself. <laughs> so did they have like I mean, a flash I, memory of him stored somewhere? I guess if you were like, I gotta become someone else. Like, yeah. you're not gonna care about your someone else, I guess, no, right? yeah. Man, I had no idea what this movie was about. <laughs> I was like, Mars, three titties, yeah, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> well, they don't hurt. We're having you fixed. Ugh. You're gonna be respectful, compliant, and appreciate They do human trafficking, too, huh? The oxygen level is bottoming out in Sector G. What do you want me to do about it? Don't do anything. Is it less than the others? Oh, hey, you can, you can Jesus. Jesus. He's what so evil. Just a bad guy. Friend. So you gotta remember any of this? Not a thing. Quade will remember that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's it feel like? Oh, crucial. Uh, those bulging veins. Yes. Yeah, believe the security team didn't stay. <laughs> they were restrained. Beat these nerds. Yellow jacket doctors. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, they're pulling out weapons. And now he has a weapon. Damn. Oh, 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 such oh, a great oh, shot. I love enough, it so dude. much. Oh. That's so good. You trust him now? You shouldn't. <laughs> but I understand why you do. Take turns spinning the fan. I don't know that would help. <laughs> Stop! We've got to get air! The reactor makes air that's going in secret. Let's go! Where'd this reactor come from? Aliens build it. Aliens? Uh. Are you sure about this? It's just up ahead. So that machine they left over from a half a million years ago is an air maker? I can't believe it! He's upgraded his car. Oh, that's good. He's Arnold. Have you seen an Arnold movie? This was his job. I'm coming for you, baby! Oh god! Oh I'm gonna suck you in, man. Bye bye, Benny. You just hear the noise. <laughs> yes! Quaid, get over here! Yeah. What is it? Cool, man. That looks great. Yeah, it does. The whole core of Mars is ice. The reactor melts it, mm -hmm. and it releases the oxygen. Enough for the whole planet. You could save the whole planet. That's part of the... Part of the package. Yep. 
These set pieces are great. They can get away with so little, too. I know. Yeah, what the hell's Mars look like, you know? What's a reactor on Mars look like? I don't know. What's a Martian alien reactor look like? Make a big room with a bunch of, like, tubes. Okay. I thought this lady was gonna turn on him. I'm like, again? <laughs> Come on, you can see them. Uh... Oh my god! Fire. It's an invincible secret agent. <laughs> uh. <laughs> it's been a while since we saw that. Yeah, okay. Shouldn't you know he had that? Didn't you guys give him the stuff? We gave it to him. <laughs> Richard was never in on the plan, though. Yeah. <laughs> you think this is the real question? <laughs> yes. God! Coming with me. Oh, God. See you at the party, Richter! <laughs> oh, so good. 1990. I know! <laughs> so that's a Martian that. hand? Oh. Get away! Get back! Mars will go into global meltdown. That's why the aliens never turned it on. And you expect me to believe you? Who gives a shit what you believe? I am Quaid. You're nothing! You're nobody! Yay. Yay. <laughs> Damn it. Not again. Ugh. Such a great shot. Why, Mick? Get his belly, he'll fall. Tickle him! Dribble spit in his face! <laughs> Yay! Oh, damn! That was like a real dude. Out in the space. Oh. I guess in the Mars, not necessarily oh, space. Oh, here comes the eyes. I want to see the bulbous eyes again. Do you? I do. Oh, God. That's oh. like a human golem. There. Yeah. Oh. Are you happy now? Yeah. Got to be oxygen and pressure. It's got to create an atmosphere. Yeah, I'll just trust the aliens. They're alien, but they're right there. I guess they said a global meltdown, right? Jeez, look at that! <laughs> oh my god! It's like an—is it inflating? Like the prosthetic there's, or something? There's a lot of different. It's so cool. It's it's a fully synthetic yeah. head. And then they have like stages. I'm assuming. Yeah, they do. It's like a volcano going off. Volcano of life. Can we get some air over here? <laughs> uh, oh, the glass. That'd be terrifying. You have no idea what's happening. Yeah. I'm not going to Mars ever. Oh, it's going on too long. <laughs> I wanted to see it, now I don't. You wanted this! You wanted to see it again! I did. They kill someone on Mars, but maybe they get oxygen next group. Yeah. The next group will be better. Like, I probably wouldn't want to be here while this is happening. Maybe after. Wow. Yeah, I know. 
thank goodness it all got better and there's no yeah. permanent damage. <laughs> yeah, like detached retinas. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> oh, gosh. Cloud stuff. Most of that cloud stuff, they would shoot like in tanks with water and just put light through it and dust and stuff. I wanted to pan over to Kohagen <laughs> and just yeah. see what he looks yeah. like right now on the ground. His eyes are just tube socks. <clears throat> Limp tube socks. That happened so quick. Mm-hmm. I loved it. The aliens knew their shit. Was it yeah, they did. It's like a reactor to terraform an atmosphere kind of uh-huh. thing or something, you know? This is a terrible Total recall. Hey, what are if, your thoughts? If, if when they kissed, he just woke up and he was in that sales office, like he was in that thing again, I wouldn't have been super upset. He might have, right? Well, that's the whole thing. Like, is it real or is it not real, right? Yeah. I mean, I get that they do this sometimes where it's like, well, make your own thing. It's like, well, with this one, I want to know. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is based off of a book. Yeah. Sure. But I mean, there's just again, it's the only thing that makes it so that he's not just the average construction Joe is that he looks like Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> yeah, that's the only thing that kept me solid throughout the entire movie. It's like I know this. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll say it was all real. Sure. Yeah. Okay. But it was a hell of a movie, which would have made a hell of a memory. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Spend. Eight well, like nine on. There's that aspect where, like, you spend so much trying to figure out. And they even toy with it throughout, yeah. right? Like, you get that one guy coming in and being like, yeah, look, you do. I'm at recall. You're at recall. You're stuck in this delusion. My favorite part of the movie. we can't wake, you, at, wake yeah. you up of it, right? But there is also an aspect. You probably didn't catch it because you didn't know where we're going with things. Uh-huh. But whenever the, he's at recall, uh-huh. um, that guy's, like, getting the implant. And he says, oh, that's a new one. Blue skies on Mars. But it's, like, one of those background, like, AOT type of comments mm-hmm. where, like, it's being said while you're seeing and looking at other stuff happening. Okay. And, you know, that's where they go with it is blue skies on Mars. So it's like saving a planet, getting the girl. And, like you said, I was going to say in the middle of it, but there is a time when he's, like, picking his girl and he's drowsy. Yeah. And he sees that girl. Yeah. Like, yeah. it's her face there. That you he's know? designing. So, like, is it designed? Is it in his mind? Yeah, is it in his mind because it's all real? He's met these people before? Yeah. So then you're she's saying, also, like, if that's the case, then the, the dreams he's having in the beginning are literally just dreams. He made the model look like the girl Yeah, he, he makes the model look like the girl who's obsessed dreams. with Mars. Yeah, because even his thing was like, no, I know she's real. I dreamt her. It's like, listen to yourself. You dreamt her, so she's real? Yeah. Like, of course she's here because you dreamt her. She's in your mind. Yeah. This You built the girl what you wanted. You wanted a brunette to have this attitude, you know? Like, I... I guess the one thing I would say is when I got out of it, like, holy crap, I thought that was real. But then I'm like, I'd be like, why'd you make a dream that's going to make me question my entire reality? <laughs> you know? Make a, make a dream that I'm like, oh, satisfied. I want another. Well, yeah, like, he, he was having an embolism yeah. or whatever, right? So, yeah. like, it was going wrong and yeah. it was mixing with his actual, like, It was a schizophrenic dreams. embolism. Yeah. yeah. So, like, it could have been a... Like, that's not how it should have went. Yeah. Sorry. It should have went. Okay. If he was actually dreaming. Yeah. But maybe there's a chance that he wasn't. His mind did have a memory cap. They unlocked that. They just made him forget that aspect so that he would go back so to the So the recall people weren't in on the conspiracy, right? So if it's all real, they didn't know. Yeah. yeah. And it's probably Hauser who was waking up there being like, you blew my cover. Yeah. I yeah. hate you. You know, like all that aspect. And then they were like, make him forget. Make him think he's, du- he's Quaid again. So did Harry mess up? But Harry knew he was going to go do the recall stuff. Right? Harry's the one that told him about the recall stuff, isn't he? No, he saw. No, he, he asked, saw an he ad. asked he Harry about it. Yeah. Oh, okay. And then Harry's like, "No, don't do that." They gave oh, yeah, it he didn't say it not. Okay, I was in my head. I was thinking. Yeah, like, my wait, cousin went there and he got lobotomized. That's right. Yeah, yeah. So he but, was trying to warm away from it. Yeah, but he did tell Harry he was going to go do it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, yeah. But I guess Harry just didn't think like it would mess anything up. I, well, I think that's why he checked in with him afterwards. Mm-hmm. Yeah. With and those then, guys. And then he was acting weird. So then those guys came and dragged him and was like, look, something fucked up. You disappeared. Now I know something's wrong and we have to, like, take care of this. Yeah. And, and there's I, still... I guess Harry was reporting to Richter. And then there's, like, how much do you think Lori just seems like his wife in the very beginning versus does she seem like she's some kind of agent plant? 
same thing with Harry. Like, he kind of gives a weird look at him, yeah. you know, afterwards. Like, is that one of those Benny looks? Like, he's into something? It's tough to go back and watch the movie again after you know, because it's like, well, now I'm questioning everything. Yeah. yeah. But, like, is that a weird look? Yeah. Or is it not? Why does she say, don't worry about Mars? Let's yeah. look at Saturn. Yeah. Does she just really hate Mars? Is she turning off the news to make him not remember who he is? You she know? did like, hate Mars. Yeah. She did. Even even in the the fantasy or whatever, she was like, you know how much I hate this fucking planet. But you As soon as she showed up, you know, when that guy was mm-hmm. trying to trick him again, as soon as she showed up, I'm like, nope. Don't trust her. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. They're just, they're, like, even so, watching now, like, there's a lot of questions. Like, could it have been fake? Is it all real? Is it too convenient? You know, I don't know. Yeah. He did save a planet. <laughs> yeah. You know, that was that was the package. Yeah, you can tell, like, The Matrix gets a lot from this original story. Oh, yeah. Um, Philip, K. Dick, Philip K. Dick novel. Mm-hmm. And I, I like the name of the short story. It's called um, We Can Remember It For You Wholesale. Uh, that's good. I, I love the part where, like... Douglas Quaid or Hauser? Hauser. When Hauser's like, oh, yeah, we tricked you. Ha <laughs> ha, me, you know? And I, I kind of wanted to go even almost further with that, but I, I like what we got. But I like the idea that, you know, he is a bad guy. Yeah. But your who you are right now is more important than who you were or who you're going to be. And sure. It always is, and that's always well, the yeah, case. Yeah, <laughs> your, your experience and your identity informs yeah. every decision that you make. Because right? by the definition, the past, you can never get back to it in the future. You're not going to get to it right now because you're stuck in the present. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Which they deal with with, uh, I, you want me to tell your future? So uh-huh. How about my past? You know, yeah, with like the psychic sure. mutant stuff. Mm-hmm. And then Quato, like Quato. he had he had a line that says, Man uh, man's defined by his actions, not his memory. Yeah. Which really goes in with what he does here, yeah. where like well, I don't you know, my memory of who I was like doesn't matter. This is what I want to do. I want to be a good guy. Mm-hmm. Save all these people, I know it's wrong, kind of thing. I think I probably have a very unique experience in that I watched that episode of Rick and Morty, felt lost and left behind because I hadn't seen this. Forgot about it. Watched this. Remembered it halfway through, and still was so surprised by Quato. Yeah, it's a hell of an effect. It's it just it's it's so different than what you expect is going to happen. I kept waiting. When's Quato show up? And I, he's like, oh, I guess that guy's Quato. And he's like, I'm not Quato. He's coming. And And he like turns around. I'm like. (laughs) <laughs> and, then, and then Rick and Morty flashed. Over yeah. I'm like, oh, open your mind. Open, <laughs> open your mind. mind. <laughs> but nothing compares to my sheer enjoyment I got from the sheer terror of those Arnold heads. Oh, those yeah. fake Arnold heads. And mm. yeah, you can tell they're fake, but I don't care because they are real. Yeah. They. Are, it's a real thing being photographed through real glass. It looks. You can't. It's so hard. You know. Like, how, how would you feel as Arnold watching that? Yeah. Watching sure. your face. Yeah, watching your face explode. Like, bloat his and nose. swell and fuck up. His nose hole oh, was yeah. so big. Pulling that thing out through his nose, it's the tracker. Big. But that's one of those things that I, I assume that, like, they have, like, all right, here it is, you know. What do you think, the director? And they're like, too big. But, the, you know, it's like uh, Peter Jackson. When yeah, he's doing no, the, bigger, he's bigger. He's doing the Witch King Mace, and they're, yeah. they're like, it, it's no one can use this. It's too big. He's like, I think it could be way, way bigger. Like, literally five times bigger. No, this is ridiculous. But then when you watch it with an audience, every time it shows up, the audience is like, oh. Yeah. And then Peter Jackson's like, Sud. he actually was disappointed. He said it could have been bigger. <laughs> he wanted. That's what that nose thing feels like to me. He it's wanted so, an anime level yeah. mace on that. I just imagine that when you're done with that, like, you're just having a loop of skin. This with sure. you all the time. Like, you jump off a building and it'll inflate. So good, though. And the eyes bulging out, they have this, like, balloon quality to them where they, like, come yeah. out. And then the the main Copenhagen, Cohagens, they were, like, yeah. cones yeah. coming out. I think they were, like, was, snail eyes. I think yeah. when he, like, died, they, like, popped oh. all the way out. And, uh, like a cartoon and character looking at a, like yeah. a pretty lady. His tongue as well. And just the squibs in this movie. Oh, yeah. Just you absolutely can, brutal squibs. Yeah, it's, stunts. Once you said it's a Robocop director, like... No question. Yeah, he just has that. Everything just looks dangerous. The yeah. automatic fire and, and the muzzle flashes yeah, the are, guns so, are dangerous. All so loud. And yeah, yeah. There's like squibs on squibs on squibs. Yeah, <laughs> it feels that like. one guy that he was using on the escalator for oh, cover. Oh man, yeah, <laughs> so brutal. I do wonder what the timeline of stuff is because I know like Friday Thirteenth started to get in trouble for its violence. So once you got to like Friday Thirteenth Part 
Kingdom Hearts was like four or six. Mm-hmm. Like they started really cutting around the kills and stuff. Yeah. So I wonder where this movie falls within that. Because I feel like this is as gruesome, if not more so, than some of the stuff right at 13th did. Hmm. Maybe. Like a lot of it is just shots to the body. As yeah. opposed to like sometimes some of the Jason stuff can get pretty crazy that they really cut around things like it's you know if they cut off a head or stab I mean, like, eyeballs and stuff he's holding you know? two arms yeah he's holding two arms that one dude gets impaled with a pipe in the head and that looks so gruesome See, the but they also they don't show the impaling they just show like yeah. a second of him turning yeah. away and falling you know like it's just they enough they did show the arms getting crushed off just enough was better than showing it too much I felt like no I think yeah. so too cause you get just a glimpse and you're like oh yeah. gosh it's so much more visceral than if I just watched it for three seconds uncut yeah mm-hmm. there's an Arnold prosthetic head in T2 in a cut scene that I always felt like it didn't work for me because it was too I'm sorry in the first Terminator the first Terminator yeah. when he's yeah. looking in the mirror yep. it holds on it too long I can start to see the seams but this one it, just, it wouldn't hold on also, too long. A lot know? lower budget in that first Terminator movie You're compared right. to. You're right. And the second they do the second one, one has I one think, too, right? is cut out when they're removing his chip. That's yeah. what I was thinking. Yeah, of, that's I cut think. out. And yeah. there's a little bit of a, I think, a fake Arnold head yeah. there, maybe. I mean, you do um, have him removing his arm. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So there's the, that. The synth skin or whatever. Yeah. yeah. This this film had an estimated budget of 50 to $80 million, which was one of the most. One of the highest, it was the highest at the of, time, of right? the time. That's yeah. awesome. And opening weekend, our movie. it grossed in U.S. and Canada twenty-five million, and worldwide total gross was two hundred and sixty-one million. Wow. So, so I think Schwarzenegger was worried that like it was going to do well mm. because it was such a huge production. Yeah, yeah. like it has to do well to make back the budget that it used. Mm-hmm. I like how um, it's also like there's alien stuff, but in terms of like the timetable of the universe, like they're not going to be around. Yeah, <laughs> like they say like, it was half a million years ago. This thing was a built, million, you know? half million, yeah, something like that. Um, yeah, but like also with that, whenever they're implanting the memory and doing the recall stuff. They mentioned that and show some little things in Italy and drill quick and mm-hmm. stuff. Too. They were so saying it's like it. that's why I was confused because they were kind of saying it around the time you would get dream stuff. So I'm like, okay, well maybe there's not actually aliens, but in the fantasies that you can play, there are. But yeah, but they say like they're finding fossils and stuff. So like yeah. there is some kind of real aspect in the real world, but it's just a matter of like, is this also from the real like world or is yeah. it from the dream world? You know? Yeah. Oh, For sure. reference, RoboCop had a budget of thirteen million. Did it? Yeah, I haven't seen that in a long time. It's been a long time for me. That was also pretty. I love that one. Hell of a movie. I've only seen the first one. I think though. Uh, I know. Two or three. Time, I'd only seen the second one. I know. What? I've seen at least two of them. I don't know if I've seen all three. I've, I've seen, seen all three many times. I. I fucking grew up with that movie. I watched it when I was like nine. <laughs> it probably scarred me for life. Ladies and gentlemen, RoboCop two. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen RoboCop and WCW. What? Yep. Did he wrestle? Did he no. arrest some wrestlers? No. Did he a wrestle? <laughs> do you need to? I mean, I, it's a movie, so sometimes you gotta do this to to communicate. But do you? Would you need to write down your handwriting next to other handwriting to tell us your handwriting, or can you tell us your handwriting? I mean, if I don't remember my handwriting, mm. well, that's true. I think right? I would recognize it, but yeah, like he said, like it's yeah. implying that his handwriting never changed. I'm assuming he's written. Well, because there's a difference between memory and like maybe muscle memory. Yeah. Right? So, like, your body just yeah. naturally does this or yeah, draws. Sure. Like, he seemed to naturally fall into his fighting techniques, I guess, yeah. right? Yeah. So, there may be that muscle memory versus, like, okay. knowing who you yeah. are. Like, I know I can like, recognize, like, my S's, my, my, my R's. Weirdly enough, like, I can recognize eyes. other people's handwriting easier than I can easier my Easier than your own? Hmm. Yeah. I still yeah. remember a test back in school where I was, like, I, me and Rick both wrote Rick's name. And then I asked people who wrote Rick's name. Yeah. And they had to, like, choose between which one. Yeah. I did a pretty good. Mine's weird. It, like if I like my notes here, I know most people aren't gonna see them, so I don't care about making them pretty. But you like do if it fast. I, if I'm writing and I know someone's gonna see it, I, I draw my letters and I can do it really well. So my letters sometimes can look completely different, but I can recognize my fast writing. Mm-hmm. As I got one speed, baby. This is what's <laughs> on my marriage certificate. <laughs> That's all I got. <laughs> they definitely got their money's worth with the three titties. Prosthetic, which I'm convinced is all three are fake. all three are fake. Okay, because yeah. they all looked equally good, and I was looking. Yes, no, two of them are three real. One just made well, it can be check. easy. I feel like to just throw a third one on. You know? But sure. then you got a match. Well, that's yeah, but that's what makes it real is the challenge of making a match. You know, like Gandalf. Uh, 
Ian McKellen has a fake nose throughout all of Lord of the Rings because he already had a pretty big nose, but once you put hair and beard and stuff on, then it looks like his nose looks way too small. So they had to put a fake one on. And when you do that, it's right next to his real skin. So you got to yeah. blend it. And it, 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 no one knows that he has a prosthetic nose on for six movies, <laughs> you know? No, I like this movie. It's just, it has a, a classicness yeah. to it that's like... It, captures that 90s yeah. maybe 80s action movie thing it too did. where like Blockbuster. all the all the yeah. aspects of like of uh prosthetics i love the the nose thing i love the the woman like that that scene whenever he like does yeah. the ear and the ear thing does its thing and like me trying to pick out exactly which seams are like real mm-hmm. or like a cgi thing or whatnot yeah. like it all just looks real good yeah it's really cool well yeah. and you know you get Seeing into the what the future is going to be like, you know, so you get all these like people walking through x rays, and that would have been crazy in yeah. 1990. Now yeah. it's like, well, yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. T- today, if you did that, I feel like I'd want to make like a little bit of a fight in there where you see skeletons and like you could break a bone, and that would look bone, so yeah. cool. Yeah. And if like oh, the remake man. didn't do that, I feel like so graphic. that was like just a bone come out of the skin, <laughs> it's yeah. not graphic, but you'd be like, oh, sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you couldn't tell where the skin was in that one, no, you would just see the bone and just the bone go, you yeah. know, and it's like, oh, shit. It's like nice. it'd, be, it'd just be so cool to do, but just ha- having him like jump through it, like it looks cool. He's like, oh, oh, yeah. Ah. I like a lot of those aspects of it. And just, I, I like that it he... ages well, too, I think. Mm-hmm. It's not, yeah, I like, I can tell, like you said, well. there's some of that Matt stuff where you're like, this looks a little weird. Sure, yeah. There was the one scene of her walking, and it was a hologram her, that, like, she didn't look like she yeah. was really standing mm-hmm. where she was. Yeah. Whereas he didn't, because they, they did the cut differently. Everything else looked great. I mean, some of the location uh, model stuff, there was one shot towards the end where... The camera's moving, but it was kind of swaying a little bit. It was bit jiggling a little bit, Because it's such yeah. a small camera, you know. Uh, and then I also liked that he kind of got to use the who is the real me against the bad guys at the end, kind of flip the tables, where he's like, you know, am I the real Quaid? Or is this the real Quaid? <laughs> it is. <laughs> you think this is really Quaid? Yeah. It is. It is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which is what they did to him, you yeah. know. So I got that he got to flip it. That was fun. It's fun them messing with that. And they don't use the hologram for, like, the whole movie. You get introduced mm-hmm. to it in all the first 20 minutes At first so. I was like, is he invincible? Is this fake? What's happening? Um, <laughs> oh, yeah. Right, yeah. Is he a Jedi? <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Now he's the king of Mars. Yeah. I guess, yeah. At yeah. least the hero of Mars. Yeah. And Benny's dead. Did Benny get you there at all? Uh, well, I mean, when they showed that shot of his face. Him being, watching yeah. the door shut. At yeah, that point. you're like, well, what's that for? That's not yeah. for nothing. They didn't be like, oh, dropped an edit. <laughs> I dropped yeah. this shot in my head. Dang it. Also, like in Total Recall, he like as he's selling, he's like, yeah, you don't need to worry about any cab drivers. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Yeah, it does seem like a really fun movie to rewatch. Yeah. Which is why I'm sure you guys were very happy. Good for oh. you. But <laughs> I, halfway through, I, I was movie. just so mad. I was yeah. like, what's happening? It's fun to watch through. That's why, like, when it, whenever they said, that's a new one, Blue Skies on Mars. Like, oh, Blue yeah. Skies on Mars. Huh. I don't remember that being said. Yeah. I'm going to write that down because that's just. I don't it, remember. Yeah, I don't even remember. I just watched it. I don't remember it. Yeah. The idea of him picking the secret agent just means, like, you're like, is this all a fake secret agent thing yeah. or a real secret agent thing? Yeah. yeah. I really don't know. Hmm. Yeah, if he had tried to do like the the Saturn Beach or, or whatever it was, and then okay. then he woke up, it's like you blew my cover. Yeah. Like it it might be a little bit easier to to know which is which then. Yeah, but like is his obsession of Mars and all that stuff because he had lived yeah. on Mars and had come from there and now does, any of that's connected? You know, does this movie have like really like famous? Fan theories, like kind of like Blade Runner, where it's like it could be this, it could be this. Is that you know, I don't know because I've never tried to look it up. And my default came, now is that it's all real. When I've watched it, like I didn't have forums yeah. and stuff that I was looking at, so I have no idea what the general okay. internet consensus is. Do you guys have any idea? Not really. I haven't really looked it up. I just know it's based on the short story, but I don't know how the short story goes either. If that's sure. more spelled out or okay. not. Sure. Yeah. Like, do they tell you at the end like mm. it is a fake memory, or is it left up for interpretation? Is that what they kind of do here? Because yeah. the only thing at the end here is him being like. What if this is all a dream? Yeah, yeah. And she just says, "Kiss him before you wake up," and then yeah. it ends. And you're like, "But did was the white? Yeah, light the white him happens. Waking, it, was that him waking up? You kind of expect like, and then the credits. Start. Oh, honey, yeah, because like we get the white light from the machine. Yeah. So it's just done in one of those ways. Where well, it's there like, are fun ones like that. Maybe people can put them down in the comments. Sure. And we read those. Yeah. yeah. That'd be fun. And they saved the name of the movie and the thing. They did. They did. You get total, oh, you know, total a good recall. Because I gotta say, it's not a very exciting title. I don't go, Total Recall, I'm like, 
I'll go watch it. You know. So no, I get what you mean. Now you understand. And there's just I, I there's it and it's a great title now. The whole movie's just mind fucks, yeah. right? You're like, mm-hmm. oh no, his thing broke. Mm-hmm. Oh, he didn't get to have his memory. Man, that's weird. Okay, well, I don't know what happened there. Oh wait, he's what? He's really a secret agent. And then they do the whole thing. It's like, oh, he's not a secret agent. And then they do like, oh, he was a secret agent, and it's all been a trick so he can get the rebel, and he's lying to himself. It's kind of like know? Terminator like, One and Two all together in one. Where it's like, <laughs> he's the good guy. No wait, he's the bad guy. No wait, he is the good guy. <laughs> yeah. Terminator 2 alternate ending is kind of a, it was all a dream because they avoid Judgment Day. True, <laughs> true. It's uh, always postponing Judgment Day. Uh, we need to watch Dark Fate now. Yes, we do. That was on this poll. It, it was. Didn't, it didn't win, but this one won. Does, does everybody understand my dilemma? See, you know what's interesting is <laughs> I don't know if the audience knows. Dark Fate is the opposite scenario yeah. because we haven't seen it. I know. And you have. Yeah. Just to let people know, I, I believe there was like, hey guys, go watch Terminator Dark Fate this weekend. We'll do a review. And I was the only one that went. And I was like, I have so much to say. And they're like, oh, we'll watch it someday. And it's been like five years. <laughs> we still have yet to talk about it. I have still yet to watch it. Yeah. I've waited for a reaction for it instead. Yeah. Yeah. But maybe one day. Yeah. Or maybe that was all a dream. And that never happened. All right. Guys, thank you so much for watching Total Recall with us. Yeah. Uh, let us know your thoughts on, was it a dream? Was it real? What do you think? Down in the comments below. And make sure to update your recommendations for movies that we should watch over at blindwave.com. And we have a poll every other week where you can help us decide what we should be watching. Find all that in links down below. Or right there.